get this. I got all of it. I got the games. I got the NES system for My name is Burf and this is my turf. I'm straight out of the thrift store. Hey, what's up? It's your boy Burf. And it's Friday. It's Friday, baby. And you know what that means. It's five thrift store Friday. So we're going to be hitting up five thrift stores today. We're going to start off at Thrift Giant, old thrifty pants. We're gonna head in there and see what kind of goodies he got. Carson, Carson, was here on Wednesday and he scored a 1993 Jurassic Park T-Rex with sound. And this sucker sells for big money. Got a little vintage out of this Thrift Giant. Carson. Yeah, well, that was Wednesday. It's Friday. They've had a day or so, day and a half to restock the shelves. So I'm hoping we got some more goodies in there today. We're about to find out. But we're going to keep our fingers crossed and pray that the thrift gods are good to me today. All right. Well, what do we got here? Let's see. We got some sort of action figure. Looks like some cars. I'm not really seeing anything. What do we got on top? Oh, there's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. And there's another turtle right there. But other than that, I don't think this box is worth getting. Oh, it looks like we've got another box here. Let's take a look on top first. Any goodies? No. And how about anything over here? Here's some Star Wars. There's a, uh, looks like a Chewbacca. There's a Sand Trooper. Looks like a Biker Scout. <laughs> There's an R2-D2, also a Yoda, and Princess Leia at Jabba's palace, dressed as the bounty hunter. I can't remember the name. Yeah, see, that's the only thing. They want 40 bucks for this whole box. And although these things are cool, it's not worth spending 40 bucks for. All right, here's another box. There's a Spider-Man. What do we got on top? Well, we got quite a few action figures on top. Here's a real big one. Here's some Fortnite stuff, like this fox. And here we've got a wrestler. Yeah, just not worth spending 40 bucks on it. All right, let's see, what do we got over here? Oh, here's that plush motorcycle we saw last week. Can we go home now? Oh yeah, why don't you go outside and start up my bike? <laughs> and who's this? A 12 inch, I'm sure he's some sort of Marvel. All right, I'm gonna put him in the cart. We might get this guy. And then we've got this first order stormtrooper. And then we've got this stormtrooper. This is a cool one. All right, I'm definitely gonna pick this one up. All right, what do we got here? We got a Darth Vader mask, and it looks like we also have a stormtrooper mask. Oh, and we also have this talking Iron Man as well. Oh, but he's missing his hand. And I do believe this is Ant-Man, right? Okay, so it turns out this is Orm from the Aquaman movie. He sells for about seven to $10. They want $4 for him. I'm gonna put him back because I really don't want him or need him in my personal collection and it's not worth getting to flip. So I'm gonna put him back on the shelf, but I am gonna get that Stormtrooper and that's for my personal collection. Dang, look at this big guy. Holy crap. <laughs> That thing is massive. I've been really trying, baby. Hey, look who I caught sleeping on the job. It's Woody. All right, guys, we're gonna go check out. I'm picking this dude up. He's 2014 Jack's Pacific Stormtrooper. And uh, he does sell for about 20 bucks and I'm gonna get them for $8.99. All right, guys, well, we're starting off on the right foot this morning. This Stormtrooper is freaking awesome. I love these Stormtroopers. I, I don't like the First Order Stormtroopers. I don't like the design of their helmets, but these guys are badass. So up next, we're gonna head off to Goody Wheel. All right, my friends, we are here. <laughs> what you got for me today, Goody Wheel? What you got for me today? <laughs> All right, fingers crossed. We're gonna pray that the goodwill gods are good to me today. We're about to head in here and see what kind of goodies they got. All right, well, let's see what we got on the shelves. Got some 12 inch action figures here. Any other goodies? Oh, here we got a dinosaur. 
T-Rex. Check it out, this Batmobile is still here. Man, why does nobody want this? If you're in the DFW area, come rescue this thing. Come to the Goodwill off of Round Grove Road and pick this thing up and save it. This is a cool piece. I personally just don't want it, but I'm really surprised. It's been here for like three weeks. All right, guys, let's go check the glass case. Oh, check this out. They got a Nintendo Entertainment System. And they've got a Super Mario Brothers 3 game back there. Hmm. I might actually pick this up. this guy out oh that's awesome <laughs> oh man guys we are now the proud owners of an nes a nintendo entertainment system and get it get this i got all of it i got the games i got the nes system for 32 dollars the game itself the system is marked at like 28.92 each of the two games i picked up were uh, ten dollars a piece but for some reason i got it all for 32 bucks so like oh man i'm so jazzed up right now let's get in the car and do a little show and tell all right guys here it is in all its glory the nintendo entertainment system we've got two controllers we've got the gun we've got the console the console alone just the console alone i saw selling for 70 dollars on ebay in addition to this, we also picked up two games. We got Super Mario Brothers 3 and Kirby's Adventure. You can see these games were $10 a piece. The console and the controllers and everything was $28.82, but she gave it all to me for $32, so I got an awesome deal on it. And these games alone sell for $20 to $25 used on eBay. And I got everything for $32. I'm so freaking jazzed up over this if you're jazzed up over this score two type jazz baby in the comments below the only downside to this is that it doesn't have it doesn't have the cords to plug into the wall and the tv and stuff like that so i gotta get some cords so to be honest i don't even know if this thing actually works i'm hoping it works i'm taking a gamble on it i think it'll probably work but i gotta get some cords for it and it also needs cleaned up you can see it's a little dirty but while I was in the store, I, you know, licked my thumb and then rubbed it on the dirt and stuff just to kind of see if that smudge stuff would come off and it will. So I think this thing's gonna clean up real nice. So I'm gonna make sure I do an update video for you guys, letting you know if the gaming system works and then show it to you once I get it all cleaned up. So man, I am really, really excited, really jazzed up over this score. So up next, we head off to Thrift Shitty. And by the way, you might be wondering, Burf, why didn't you pick up that Spider-Man? It looked epic. You're right, it did look epic. But they wanted $60 for that Spider-Man. I looked them up on eBay and that is retail fees. Those are eBay fees, so I passed on it. No way I'm paying that kind of money for something like that. 15 bucks, I would have been all over it, but not for 60. Anyway, just wanted to let you know why I didn't grab Spidey. All right, my friends, we are here. <laughs> you know, I had a good feeling about this morning. I knew we were gonna score something epic. And that NES system, man, that, that is epic. All right, let's head in here. Let's keep our fingers crossed. Pray that the thrift gods are good to me today and maybe some more vintage will turn up. We got some vintage 90s right there in the house with that system and the, and, and the games, man. Oh. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for that. I can't wait to can't wait to get the cords, plug it in and play it. All right, well, I guess we'll see what we got in baggie land. Doesn't look like there's anything there. Anything in this bag? Nope. And what's in this bag here? Looks like we got some dinosaurs in there, but nothing else. All right, anything on the shelves? Well, we got a Hess truck and like a T-Rex bottle cap or something. What do we got back here? What's this? some sort of gun oh yeah i remember seeing this last week he's missing an eye so he's got an eye on that side and he's missing his eye right there 
And looks like we got a birthday cake topper of a baseball player. Oh, what's this good guy? Oh, check him out. He's kind of cool. He looks older. Check out this play set. This thing is super cool. That would look really good with some Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle figures. All right, kids, you know what time it is. It's time to check the glass case. Oh, here we go. We actually saw this last week. This playset is so cool. And it looks like we got a Blue Jays action figure and looks like a bobblehead back there. You know, I wonder if one of these cords might work for my game. All right, guys, I think I found a plug for it. Uh, I'm gonna run out to the car and grab it and just check it out before I purchase it. All right, we're gonna see if this works. Okay. Is that plug in? Oh, yeah, plugs in perfect. All right, guys, we got that plug for a buck. All right, we are ahead of the game. Literally, <laughs> gaming, right? No pun intended. Actually, yeah, pun intended. Up next, Thrift Giant. Old Thrifty Pants. Let's head that way and see what kind of goodies they got. All right, my friends, we are here. Thrift store number four. All right, we're about to head in here, see what kind of goodies they got. We're going to keep our fingers crossed and pray that the thrift gods are good to me today. And hopefully we can continue this epic streak. <laughs> All right, let's see what they got. Whoa, check out this bad boy. I want 159 for that, man. Oh, if I were a kid, I would love to have something like that. Oh, check out these Lincoln Logs. That's cool. I used to have Lincoln Logs when I was a kid, man. I loved them. I played with them all the time. All right, well, let's see what we got over here. What's this thing? It looks like it probably goes to some sort of Hot Wheels playset. Oh, check this out. We got a remote control helicopter. They want $16.91 for it. Hey, check out this Maisto Harley Davidson Heritage Spinner. So this, this thing sells for about $10 on eBay, so it's not worth a lot of money. It is pretty cool though. It's $2.99 and it would be really good for three and three quarter inch action figures. It's 1 18th scale. I'm not gonna get it, but it's a pretty cool bike. I'll oh, check this out. It's a Precious Moments Bride. It's actually from 1992. I might have to look that up and see if that's worth something. All right, so they only want $3.99 for, she sells for between like $9 and $34. There was a wide range of prices that people paid for her so i'm not going to get her for that reason it's i don't know i don't know what i could actually flip her for but she's cute and anybody that loves precious moments if you come over to the thrift giant off of mill street in Louisville, she's going to be sitting right here on the shelf waiting for you all right let's skin out of here all right guys boosted at thrifty pants all right up next goody wheel all right, my friends, we are here. <laughs> Final destination. What you got for me today, Goody Will? What you got for me today? <laughs> All right, let's head in here. We're gonna keep our fingers crossed, pray that the vintage Goodwill gods are good to me today, and we're gonna finish strong. Finish strong, just like Coach always said. Finish strong. All right, so let's head in here and see what they got. All right, well, let's see what the shelves can produce today. Now, what's this? Oh, it's nothing I'm interested in. An Iron Man, and check it out. We got our friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. What's this thing? Looks like he's missing, yeah, he's missing a back leg, whatever he is. Hey, we got some King Tut Tutankhamun playing cards, or maybe they're collector's cards. It says the Franklin Mint here on the back. I don't know if they're playing cards or collector's cards. Hey, check out this guy. Little T-Rex action. He's actually almost 90s. He's from 2000. All right, guys. Boosted. But that's okay, man. We had an epic day, didn't we? We got a Nintendo Entertainment System and we got a like big 18-inch Jax Pacific Stormtrooper. 
life just doesn't get any better than that. So, but hey, if you're enjoying watching this content as much as I'm enjoying making it for you, do me a favor, smash that like button. I can't even begin to tell you how much that would really help me out. When you let YouTube know that you like my content, they tend to push it out to more people. More people get introduced to my channel. So it'd be a big help. So just smash the like button. Also let me know, was there anything on today's adventure that you would have picked up that I didn't? Did I miss anything? Sometimes I miss stuff. Like that time that I missed that vintage Ghostbusters trap at Goodwill over in Irving. And uh, you guys pointed it out and said, dude, you missed, you missed it. You missed it, you blew it, you blew it. So anyway, let me know if I missed anything. Also give me a follow on Instagram and take any talk at 80s Toys Rock and Rock is spelled R-O-C. In the meantime, I'll catch you on the flip side.